Okay, so here's the new improved version of the Infinity Mirror guitar. It's um, it was bought brand new from Thoman, um, and I've modified it with um, hollowing out the body and fitting a, an LED strip around the inside perimeter, and um, adding 3D printed parts. The battery compartment is in here, you can access the batteries by removing the cover. Okay, they have four 1.2 volt um, rechargeables. I would insist on using 1.2 volt rechargeables as opposed to 1.5 volt standard batteries. Um, the LED strip is rated at 5 volts, so 4 times 1.2 is 4.8 volts. If you put in 1.5 volt batteries, then you're going up to, what, 6 volts, which is above the rating of the LED strip, so don't do that. Um, the remote control for the controlling the LED strip can be slid out of its housing there if you do wish to use it outside of the, the housing. Um, it's infrared remote and the infrared receiver is there. Okay, so it's got direct access to communicate to the receiver. <coughs> and I've set it up reasonably well, I think. I've settled the action up with the intonation. up there's a switch there to turn the power to the lights on and off okay so you're not using up the bat the batteries and all always being used all the time that they're in there so you can switch the batteries on and off and I've also made a few little holes here um, so that you can see if the 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 um, micro processor is on or not you perhaps can't see it in this light but certainly in darker lighting you can actually see if the computer's on through those holes okay and then once you've activated the batteries you can then turn the lights on with the on button here okay so there we can see we've got the red. Let's just take this remote out. Hang on. I've just hit the green button on the remote. <laughs> so if I hit the blue button. And the back. For the room. There we go. Yeah. Uh, we've got various other preset colours. There's pink there. If I hit that, see pink. Uh, what else have we got? Okay, so we've now, if we go on to the, there's the two white middle buttons. There's a an M plus and an M minus. They will allow you to cycle through all the modes, the animation modes. So if I hit M plus, mode increase. It goes on to the first animation mode, which is a simple flashing. If I hit M again, it does a Knight Rider effect. Hitting M again. Where, where are we? There we go. Okay, that's like a striped effect. The next mode. That's like a twinkling effect. 
the next mode that's a striped multicolor effect you can change the colors as you um, on a number of these modes so if we stay on this striped mode if I hit the white button it will change the colors to red white and blue which is pretty cool okay if I hit for example the if I hit the blue button on this mode it changes the colors of the stripes okay so there's various striped effects you can have let's just go back to pink okay where were we modes right next mode that's a night rider rainbow effect next mode that's like a, sh a shimmering rainbow effect next mode that's uh, another rainbow effect <laughs> next mode that's a gentle fade in between the colors okay and finally we have a random mode where each LED lights up as a random colour. Hit, hit mode again and we're back to the start which is a solid colour. So yeah that's just hitting the, the M plus button. You can go backwards through that cycle with the M minus button. Uh, you've also got speed, two speed controls there S plus and S minus. So that speeds up and slow down, slows down the animations. And you've also got brightness up and down, so you can um, decrease the brightness of the LEDs or, or increase them. Okay, by default it comes on at the maximum brightness. Okay. Um, what else have we got? Well, there's the off button. Obviously it turns the LEDs off. Okay, hit on again. Okay, let's just show you what the auto does as well. There's an auto button at the top. If we're on, for example, I don't know, the strike one of a an animation. Okay, like the striped animation. If you hit the auto, it takes it back to the solid colors okay so it's like a shortcut button to the very first mode so so i thought that might be quite useful if you don't want to keep hitting the, the um mode buttons to get back to a solid the solid color you've got a shortcut there to do that <coughs> so yeah they're all the that's the basic overview of the um, modes. Let's put the night rider on. I like the night rider, the rainbow night rider looks nice. Yeah. So some of yeah, as I as I said earlier, some of these animations you can actually change the colour of whilst you're on that. So, for example, we've got a glitter effect there. If you hit the white, the white color button down the corner there, whilst it's on that animation, it will change to white. It does look a bit blue in the video, but it is pretty close to white. Okay, or hit the green. Okay, so a number of those animations will allow you to do that. Okay. So, yeah, I'm very pleased with the result. One thing I'd like to point out is um, there is a slight whistling underneath the 
the sound of the guitar and um, unfortunately you can't do much and you can't do really much about that um, it's the LEDs causing a little bit of interference into the pickup however you can minimize that by rolling the tone back a little bit and in addition to that if you turn the brightness down just a little bit so if I if I turn click the brightness button three times one two three that whistling is nearly gone you prob I probably can't hear even hear it at this volume when it's present um, if I turn crank the amp up to say gig volume that sound is barely there if I turn the tone back up again you might just hear it and uh, let's turn that brightness back up there we go so that whistling is, is there at volume but it's in my opinion I would gig this guitar with no problem. Um, let's turn that down, neighbours. <laughs> let's put, put it on distortion. Put, I'll just turn the amp on distortion. that whistle but you turn the tone down a little bit add the brightness down a little bit you can barely hear it 